It is a great pleasure to be able to address you today and first of all to congratulate Pakistan on this extraordinary initiative. My task in a few minutes is to put this into a wider international context and look at it in terms of current developments worldwide. One cannot underestimate the critical importance of having an effective, speedy, trusted dispute resolution system for the constituency outside of one's country, for international users. Famously in London, we have our commercial court, and that has now been going since the late 1800s, but it's picked up uh, speed and popularity in recent years. It is now a focal point of the legal system in England and Wales. But what most people don't realize is that 80% of the users of the London Commercial Court are not English or from the UK. They are international users. And what the London Commercial Court has done is to tailor its procedures to make them bespoke in order to cater specifically for the needs of those international users. The same thing has happened now worldwide. Singapore has begun the Singapore International Commercial Court. France has begun English language commercial courts. Same in Germany, same in China. Worldwide, people are waking up to this need. And the OPC, for me, is an integral part of this movement. The foreign constituency at the moment here are overseas Pakistanis. But this is a momentum that must be capitalized upon because beyond the overseas Pakistanis, there are other international users who will be looking at Pakistan, looking at this initiative with great admiration. If one drills down uh, to see why this development has happened worldwide, there are three core drivers. The first driver is obviously effective dispute resolution for the users themselves. And that means speedy, trusted, something which will instill confidence, something which will actually secure concrete results in a reasonable period of time. But the second one is actually to create an environment in Pakistan or any other country that is generally thought attractive for more foreign investment. Because capital is free flowing and it flows to those countries where there is confidence. And therefore it is absolutely essential that you have effective dispute resolution in order to encourage further investment. But the third driver people don't often think about. The third driver is that it's been shown now worldwide. If you have an effective dispute resolution system, such as the OPC initiative, you will have other side effects coming from that which are incredibly important, such as an increase in prestige of the country internationally. That has an impact on foreign relations. It has an impact on the position of Pakistan internationally at the diplomatic level. Invisible earnings. London has tested this empirically. By having an effective commercial court, more people look to London, look to English law, and want to come to England and actually use its facilities. Connected to that, what has been found is that if you increase standards for foreign users, what you actually do as a byproduct is increase standards for local users because you're bringing in international norms into your system. And that will bleed into domestic cases. People will then experience what international norms are. Lawyers will get trained. Judges will get trained. And so in the end, ultimately, what other countries have found is that this distinction between international and domestic needs starts to erode. Actually, all standards get increased, and that can only be for the better good of everybody. So ultimately, one must see this initiative as part of a wider worldwide initiative 
Along with it in the future, one must hope for commercial courts for all users, not just overseas Pakistanis, an effective trusted arbitration system, an effective trusted mediation system. That is a whole dispute resolution ecosystem, all interconnected. This is a very powerful beginning. I commend all of you. I commend all the honorable judges and all the people behind this, but I also wish that you captivate, secure, seize this momentum, don't stop here, and move forward so that the entire ecosystem becomes a, on, at the level of international standard and instills international confidence. Thank you very much.